In part one of this tutorial, I typed in these few lines and used Open Babel to generate 3D coordinates of six atoms that make up an ethene molecule, two carbon and four hydrogen atoms, and I imported the 3D data into Blender to make a model of the ethene molecule. Next I'm going to make a model of the ethane molecule which has eight atoms and these are the connections of the carbon atoms. Atom 1 is connected to atom 2, 3, 4 and 5 and atom 2 is connected to atom 1, 6, 7 and 8. For ethane this connect record needs to be changed to 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 spaces 5 and this connect record needs to be changed to 2, 1, 6, 4 spaces, 7, 4 spaces, 8. Clicking convert, only two hydrogen atoms are added. With ethene, we could get away with typing in only the carbon atoms, but with ethane, it doesn't work. So I'm going to put in the hydrogen atoms. Change the C to H. We've got three atoms. Control and V gives us four, five, six, seven, eight. And change the serial numbers. Now when we click convert, we get the coordinates of all eight atoms. Untick output below only, click the three dots and go to the folder where you're saving your PDB files. Name the file ethane1.pdb and click save and don't forget to click convert. In Blender, press A twice to select all and X to delete. File Import PDB. Click Presets and select Mesh Half. Go to the folder where the PDB files are saved. Select Ethane and Import. Drag to open up the Outliner window and we see the four master objects. In the object menu, apply make duplicates real. Scroll down, right click on the carbon master and delete hierarchy, right click on hydrogen, delete hierarchy, right click on sticks carbon, delete hierarchy, scroll right down, right click on sticks hydrogen, delete hierarchy. Zoom in with the mouse wheel, select a carbon atom, press A twice to select all and click join. In the object menu, transform origin to geometry. Click the object properties button and give the model a more meaningful name. And set the X, Y and Z locations to zero. In the view menu, toggle quad view. In the right view, press R to rotate and line the molecule up with the Y axis. In the top view, press R to rotate and again line the molecule up with the Y axis. In the view menu, toggle quad view. Click the material button and with carbon selected, click the diffuse color and drag to make the carbon darker and change shading to smooth. The next molecule is ethine, also known as acetylene. It has a triple bond between the carbon atoms. The connect records for the carbon atoms are atom 1 is connected to atom 2 three times and atom 3, and atom 2 is connected to atom 1 three times and atom 4. I have typed the triple bonds into the connect records and I'll see if I can get away without putting in the hydrogen atoms. 
Open Babel has generated the 3D coordinates for the correct atoms, but as with ethene, there are only single bonds in the connect records. Untick output below only, click the three dots and go to the folder where you're saving your PDB files. Save the file as ethine1.pdb, click save and don't forget to click convert. Copy the connect records. Untick input below, click the three dots and open the ethine PDB file. Tick input below and paste over the connect records, putting the triple bonds in. File, save input text as and save as ethine2.pdb. In Blender, press A twice to select all, X to delete, File, Import, PDB, and set the presets to Mesh Half. Go to the folder where you have your PDB files, select Ethine2 and Import. We get error messages, there's a divide by zero error, a location unknown error, and we get nothing in the scene. Is it the triple bond causing the problem? Well, if I import the ethine1.pdb file, that hasn't got the triple bond. I still get the same error messages and no sticks, but I do get the atoms. I will carry on and finish the model putting in the sticks myself. Press A twice to select all. In the object menu, apply, make duplicates real. Scroll down in the outliner window, right click carbon, delete hierarchy. Right click hydrogen, delete hierarchy. Select a carbon atom, press A twice to select all. Click join. In the object menu, transform origin to geometry. Click the object properties button and set the X, Y and Z locations to zero. Add mesh cylinder, press S to scale 0.1 and enter. Press S to scale, Z for the Z axis, six and enter. Press R to rotate, Y for the Y axis, 90 and enter. Shift D and enter to duplicate and set the X location of the duplicate to 1. Click the Material button, click the Browse Material button and set the Material to Hydrogen. Select the original cylinder and set its material to Carbon. Duplicate, Shift D and enter and set the Z location of the duplicate to point two. Duplicate, shift D and enter and set the Z location of the duplicate to minus two. Select the hydrogen bond, duplicate, shift D and enter and set the X location of the duplicate to minus one. Select the original cylinder, press A twice to select all and click join and call the model Ethine. Click the Material button and with Carbon selected, click the Diffuse color and drag to make it darker and change shading to Smooth. Experimenting with the PDB add-on, I was able to import an ethene molecule with a triple bond even though the molecule doesn't exist. Why the add-on has problems with ethine, I haven't worked out yet, maybe because it's a linear molecule. For benzene, I did this layout with atom 1 connected to atom 2 by a double bond and connected to atom 6 by a single bond. Typing that into Open Babel without the hydrogen atoms and clicking Convert I have jumped ahead, I have saved the output file as benzene1.pdb 
I've used that as the input file. I've ticked input below so I can edit the file. And I've put the double bonds in. I've got to put the last one in. Atom 6 is connected to Atom 5 twice. Now I'm going to file, save input text as, and save it as benzene2.pdb. And save. Back in Blender, press A twice to select all and X to delete. File, import PDB. Set the preset and import Benzene 2. And it works. I'm going to leave it as an exercise for the viewer to finish off the model in the same way that we finished off all the other models. I'm going to delete the masters, right click, delete hierarchy, and the sticks hydrogen is at the end, select it and delete hierarchy. That's the end of the tutorial. I'll put the PDB files and the Blender models for you to download at my website. Click the link for my website or the eye icon. If you'd like to subscribe, click the link or the stickman. Thanks for watching and goodbye.